With the Hobbit out of the way, Tolkien returned to inventing the lost world of Middle-earth, the world of the Silmarillion. Yet extraordinarily, the basis for this world was not characters or stories, but the imaginary languages he had been working on since he was a boy. Tolkien said about his own work, the invention of languages is the foundation. The stories were made to provide a world for the languages rather than the reverse. Now this is a really astonishing statement and people have actually been very reluctant to believe him. They've assumed that he was joking or something. But we know he started off inventing the languages. We know that he has the elvish greeting, Elen Sila Lumen Omentielmo, may a star shine on the hour of our meeting. He wanted to find a world in which characters were likely to say that kind of thing. What I'm doing now is to try and write in Elvish, I'm sick. my writing is very inferior to the old, a standard meeting when meeting, a star shines upon our meeting. Oh, God. I made a mistake, didn't I? And that stands for Ellen, Sila, Lumen, or Menti Elvo. I wouldn't mind other people knowing it and enjoying it, but I didn't really want to uh, make, like some uh, people who have uh, been equally inventive in language of doubt, who want to make cults and have people all speaking it together. 